Oh my god, imagine when I get here and I have to play Roma, Arsenal, Liverpool and Manchester City with like three days in between. Let's be honest though, my squad looks sick, my bench looks amazing and the squad depth isn't too bad either. Yo, what's going on? Welcome back to Bros. Got Game, this boy Sonny and we are back with another episode of that Manchester United career one that as you guys know in the last one, we ended the January transfer window but that does not mean that we are not still talking transfers because as you guys know, I did ask you guys, do you want to see a second season or do you want to see a new career? Mode. a few people said yes do a second season a few people said do another career mode now what i'm thinking is i could stream the second season and obviously when i drop the new the new series it would be a different team i'm thinking Bayern munich dortmund juventus those kind of teams chelsea arsenal a few premier league teams as well but my main focus is on taking it away from the premier league now with the man united career mode i'm thinking i could stream it and obviously when the vods go up there will be like two hour streams and you guys could watch them back if you really want to know what's going on a few people's been linked with linking me with Mbappe. A few people's been linking me with Usman Dembele. You guys can have your say in those live streams once I start streaming this career mode when we get to season two as well. But first off, we need to get through that FA Cup against Everton and obviously get through the first season. So let me know who you want me to transfer so I can see your comments for when we get to that season. I can bring them in as well. And whilst I go ahead and move the team around, if you guys want to go ahead and support me as well, because obviously the apocalypse has happened in the recent few days and obviously I'm making like 20p off two thousand views now if you guys don't follow me on twitter you would have saw that i said literally i made two thousand views on a video and it made like 20p if you guys want to go ahead and support me you can become a member of the channel that would be appreciated or you can donate to the channel the links are also in the description down below or if you haven't got the money to do that just subscribe to the channel turn your notification on and smash that like button that would also be appreciated as well listen to them the evertonians at goodison park i mean it's a big cup tie in the fa cup against manchester united i see why they're getting hyped up for for it it's a big game and everton actually do show up for the games against man united as well so it could be a huge game oh my god there's been a revamp they've brought in sarabia the or however you say that demarcus lasalle's kieran tierney so many new players that's four already in the starting lineup for everton an absolute revamp didn't see that one coming but what you've been waiting for the man united lineup and i do read the comments down below all right because as you guys can see i am starting memphis Depay. Calm down. I do start them. I usually sim them when they're in the games or if they're not in the games, I'm usually playing them as a substitute and stuff like that. Don't worry. Depay does play games. Rashford plays games. Bale plays games. These players play games. You just probably don't see any highlights. Play forward into Lingard. Backs up into the feet of Pogba. Pogba to Lingard. Now on the left-hand side is Bale. Little fakey. Back into Jesse. What is that? Oh, it's a corner. Can be forgiven then, Lingard. Whipped in and headed off the line it's probably going wide anyway Sander Burge into Memphis Depay Burge back into Rashford down the right hand side is Gareth Bale Memphis Depay making up ground on the left hand side it's whipped in it's Rashford with the touch it's a penalty I don't know what he's given a penalty for but he's given a penalty maybe there was a little tug maybe he's grabbed onto me maybe he's done a smalling put his arms all over the gaff boys but either way it's a penalty Manchester United he's coming to the back of me I see it there Coming to the back of me. Took out my kneecap, boys. I see it. Memphis Depay. Since you guys want to see so much of him, Memphis Depay stepping up from the penalty spot. Here we go. Memphis to the left hand side. You got yourself the goal as well, boys. All right. You wanted to see Memphis. Look at him. He's doing little flicks. Little flicks of the foot. You want to see Memphis Depay on the pitch. I'll give you goals with Memphis as well. Not only shots, not only chances, but goals too. He's going with the 27 now because I had to give 7 to. I think it was Darbala, I maybe no to Jaden Sancho, and number ten is on Marcus Rashford. I told you, I read the comments, I got you. Here we go again. Then played forward into Martial, Pogba, little touch on into Memphis, to the right hand side. Jaden Sancho, little fakey. Sancho cuts in. Sancho chance. I'm offside. I think. Am I off? I'm not offside. We can celebrate two nil, and it's Paul Pogba. He gets himself into the box, puts it into the back of the net. Come on. That's what I'm talking about, man. We get chances, we don't get goals until now. And it's Jaden Sancho who is taken to literally split the defence apart with a bit of a run. Come on, Jaden. Plays it forward. 
into Rashford, back into Jaden. Link up from the Englishman and puts it into the middle. Martial, it's just beautiful. Once Jaden Sancho, Martial and Rashford start linking up, the play is beautiful. If I could get Memphis to be a part of that front four or front five with Pogba as well, just putting himself in there, that would be such a dominant force to be reckoned with. Look at the play between them. Intricate passing ball in. It's just easy. Rashford, Memphis to pie. Plays the ball forward now into Martial. The link-up play may have just happened, boys. As Martial gets through, Memphis Depay, it's four. It comes out of Pickford, and Memphis Depay puts in the fourth goal, and he's part of it now. He's becoming a part of it. That force to be reckoned with at Manchester United, boys. It's on fire, and hopefully he gets even better. When he came to the club, when I paid his buyback clause, he was on absolute fire. He stopped playing like that, and now he's back. Full-time, 4-0 against Everton in the FA Cup. What a result. Took a few substitutions to get there, but what a result. What do you mean you need a bigger role at the club, Chris Smalling? They don't call me the mad rotation manager for no reason. Manchester United versus Burnley, and I want to give players chances. So that's exactly what I'm doing. Let's have a look at that lineup. Smalling coming in at right back. Didn't really want to do it, but he wants to play football. And I wanted Eric Bialindo to be playing this game. McTominay comes in. We got Sancho alongside Martial. And we got my boy Memphis up top again. I wanted Rashford in cam. He couldn't do it though because of the fitness of Rashford. But it doesn't matter. We're going through with this game. And hopefully we can pick up a victory with that great squad that we've got out there anyway. Our squad depth is crazy. I told you. I see you, Martial. Into the middle of Memphis. I see you, boys. Just keep running. Just keep running. There you go. Little overlapping run from Dalo. Dalo whips it at the cross. It's come out. Only as far as McTominay is coming back in. He's offside anyway. I think my player there. McTominay will win the ball in the head. On the, in the head. In the air. Martial. Curler. Wide. Close him down, boys. Close him down. Eric Bailly's had to come out. Where is Smalling at? Dalo's defended it. It's off the post. Back to him, David De Gea. Oh, my God. Big save. That should have been a goal, Burnley. Massive save from the hair. The baller into McTominay. Sancho. Sancho into Martial. Back into Sancho. Now into McTominay. Down the right hand side is Memphis. Depay goes for the far post. Come on. That's what I'm talking about. Memphis Depay with the goal. And that's exactly what we look for. Those chances. Those intricate passing chances. McTominay with the assist as well. Well done to the young player, the Scottish lad. Actually had a decent game against Liverpool in my opinion and I could see him maybe being a future Matic replacement. But for me, goes up there, plays like a cam and does it well. Angel Gomez in off the bench. He's got players with him. Romelu Lukaku back into the Angel. The kid, the youngster. Here he goes. It's Angel. What a save. He's taking everything away from the kid. Angel Gomez nearly... Corner Man United though, towards that penalty area please, it's headed in and it's past the post. Come on man, Burnley just applying pressure right at the end, we're already past the added minutes. He's letting them take this last attack, he's going to give them the corner as well. We're into the 93rd when it was 90 plus 2. I swear to God if they score. David, easy. Get that out of there, full time 1-0 boys, not the best of um, score sheets. Definitely not the best of my games either. They put me under pressure, man. They had chances, Burnley. But either way, we've come away with the three points. And that takes us, even though Liverpool have a game in hand, to 19 points ahead of Liverpool. Also, Arsenal up there as well, but they've played 27 games. Crystal Palace. So basically, we've catched up to where we are in real life right now. Salhurst Park is where we're going to be playing the game. Have we put out the lineup that's going to be beating them? Hopefully we have. Surely we have. It's my first team. Here's the lineup. They call me rotation gun. I've said it before. I'll say it again. However, we're back to my first team, boys. Linda and Kulabali at the back with Shaw and Mooney yeah, on the sides. we got Pogba and Herrera in the middle. Instead of Matic, I just prefer Herrera is just more agile. You can see the squad right there. You can see how good we look. Let's go win. Under Herrera. I told you, this is why I like him, boys. He's so agile. Cuts everything out. Interceptions. Bang! What a goal! I've hit it and already before it's ended up in the back of the net, I said bang! Because I knew that was floated in. 1-0 within the opening minutes. Only 10 minutes in, boys. And we're at their home stadium as well. We're making it look like... At my home stadium. Martial plays a short one to Lingard. Back into Martial. Whips it in. Oh, that looked like he could have been going in. 
I mean, let's be honest, he's probably scored our best goals this season. Look at him. The work rate of Herrera, man. Such a good work rate. Play that back into Pogba, Jesse. Lingard, Rashford. Here's Martial back into Rashford. Rashford plays it across into Jesse Lingard. And that is what I'm talking about. I'll start this guy because he does stuff like that. Not that celebration, but agile play. You don't see that from Darbala. I mean, Darbala scores some wicked goals. You know, he smashed them into the top corner. He'll play some really good assists that you don't see from any other player. But that intricate passing style that I like to play, Darbala just doesn't fit. He does. Anthony Martial. Still Anthony. The ball forward. Oh, it was nearly going to work as well for Bale. That defender got in his way, though. And then down. Oh, my God. What the hell was that? Down the right hand side wasn't exactly the greatest of balls either. Into the middle. Chance. Should have been a goal. Big save off the post as well. Can't believe this. I just got. Get that out of there, boys. Get that out of there. There you go. There you go. Little knock on. Little knock on. Here you go. Bang. Bail. Easy. Easy. I'll move Bale into the cam roll and then move Lingard into the right wing roll. And it's worked out already. Literally like two minutes ago. That is what I'm talking about, man. Get him in that cam roll. That's what, that's what he needs to be. Good finish. Crystal Palace nearly. Crystal Palace nearly. They're trying to get through. Nearly get through. They could get through. The chance, David De Gea. He, keep, he wants his clean sheets, boys. He wants to keep keeping those clean sheets. Chongi backs it up. Into Andres Pereira. Looks for that bottom corner. He's done them before. You saw him smash him in. He just couldn't do it that time. Palace trying to get one goal at least. A consolation goal it will be. But at least one goal from this game. Colabali says no. And that's the full-time whistle. That's Salhurst Park. And we've picked up the 3-0 victory. Is that from things to come later on today? Let me know in the comment section down below, boys. Is it going to happen? Let me know if you watched the game as well. And then you saw this video and it happened or it didn't happen. Oh, just give it to Roya, man. Give it to the Cardiff City player. Why not? February as well. Sanchez is controversial. We knew it. We've made that 80 mil where we could, boys. He's getting worse. Here we go, then. We're at Wembley. The Carabao Cup final. Nobody gives a crap about it. Even Man City didn't look like they gave a crap about it. However, it means silverware. Can we do the quadruple? We want to get the Carabao Cup. I want to then take home the FA Cup, the Premier League trophy, and the Champions League trophy all in this season. If I can't, then obviously season two just gives us an even better thing to go after. But if I do do that, huge boys. We are unbeaten still. I am the rotation god, boys. We've got with Sergio Romero in goal, Jiang and Guau. I think he's how you say that, oh, Giao also gets his debut. They play alongside each other for the first time for the Youth Academy. We've got Smalling and Delo at the back joining them. Burge, Fred and McTominay. We've got Harlan, Chung and Sancho. We're looking all good in the hood. And it's all for that right there. The Carabao Cup. Let's go get it. Fred into the feet of Harlan. Back into Fred. Fred plays it out wide. Sancho. Fred. Fred turns his man. It's Fred. He takes the shot. It's a goal. Just like that. Man like Fred puts it into the back of the net. You can't stop us, boys. All right, he's falling over. It doesn't matter. 1-0. Carabao Cup football against Preston with players that shouldn't even be on the pitch. And they're scoring goals. Even Youth Academy players we brought through like Guau and Jiang down there. Two minutes in and we scored a goal. Corner at Preston. They've got a lot of tall players and I think they do. All they keep doing is getting the ball out wide and whipping in crosses. Oh my God, they've hit the post. Get that out. This is actually the worst game I've ever played, boys. We're only 23 minutes in and I can feel it. It's going to be a slugfest. I mean, I'm willing to take 1-0 at this point. I feel like I'm playing Barcelona. I don't know if it's just in my head or I'm tired or I don't want to play anymore what it is, but I feel like I'm playing Barcelona. Oh, here come Barca. Barcelona. Oh, my God. Now, let's blow the whistle. Done. Done. I'll take it, boys. I'll take it. 1-0 against Preston, but I struggled the whole game. Literally the whole game. I scored for foot though in the fourth minute as soon as the game kicked off. And then after that, you might as well have just told Preston to keep peppering my goal. Luckily, Romero was in form, but I'm never playing this team again because it's just so bad. They're all happy. I'm happy that we got the cup. Nobody cares about it. Even Man City didn't look happy holding it. But, you know, the performance wasn't as good as I thought it would be with all my youngsters out there. But they got the experience. They got the cup as well. He's been complaining about not getting enough football. Now he can go and lift himself a trophy in the Carabao Cup. Go on there, Smalling. Lift it up for a sign. There it is. The first of many here at Manchester United. Boys, we play for the Badger. Let's go. Carabao Cup now in our grasp. 
We're taking it on to Manchester, the red side. There's only one side, and that's red. Look at the celebrations. The celebrations will go on throughout the night for the Carabao Cup trophy. Chris Smalling, Guao, Jiang, you know, those kind of players. Didn't expect to be holding that trophy today, but guess what? They are. All right, they played against Preston. Even though Preston looked like the better team, we've won against Preston, and we picked up the W. Come on. 91 manager rating right now, by the way. And below is a list of players. Okay, so Hong as well in our little youth squad report. Part G Hong, I like to call him. And now you for Champions League football against Roma for that second leg, boys. We'll be getting back to that in the next episode. If you guys want to see more of this, you know, what to do go ahead and smash out the like button down below comment in the comment section down below what you guys want me to do in this career mode as well and if you think the live stream in the second season is a good idea also if you guys want it you can also donate or become a member the links are at the top of the description follow me on all my social medias the links are down below as well catch you in the next one peace